Hey, it's Josh, and I'm in Montreal, Quebec. I'm here with my fiancé, Heath. Hi. And we're going to bring you along with us as we explore this city during Fierté Montréal. So we stayed at the Humanity Hotel, which is right downtown, a great location to get around from. And as you can see, it's quite modern and stylish. It's only been open for about a year and there are a lot of amenities like a rooftop bar and pool. And before checking out the different pride stuff going on, we wanted to see some of the city. So we went to the Botanical Gardens where we really could have spent the whole day because it's huge. Lots of little themed gardens within it, where of course you can check out all kinds of plants and flowers flowers and wildlife. There's also an insectarium there where even though I'm not much of a bug person, it was interesting to check out the different insects that they've got on display, learn about the different insects and hang out with the butterflies one of which really seemed to like my fiance. He's taken. <laughs> for lunch, we went back downtown to Le Central for like a next level food court. Everything here is like an independent restaurant. There's no chains or anything and really interesting, unique food that was quite delicious. So that was a yummy lunch. And then we walked over to the McCord Museum to check out JJ Levine's queer photographs. So uh, the photographer here questions the representation of traditional binary gender roles through the photographs. And then back to our hotel for dinner at H3, which is, as you can see, quite high end, quite fancy dinner. And the best part is you can actually have your dessert in their wine cellar among their 3000 bottles of wine. That was pretty cool. And the next day we went to the Yayoi Kasuma exhibit at the PH1 Foundation for Contemporary Art. This is dancing lights that flew up to the universe. And there's a couple spots where you can walk around and it just doesn't seem to begin or end. Pretty trippy. But of course you can't go to Montreal without going to Schwartz's for a fresh smoked meat sandwich. So we went to this iconic deli and lined up for about 45 minutes to get in, but I'd say it was worth it. And finally, it was time to do some pride stuff. So we went down to the community days at St. Catherine Street West in the heart of the gay village. The community days take place over two days to hang out with thousands of LGBTQ people. And not far from there, we went for dinner at Red Tiger to have their sharing menu, which was a lot of food for the two of us, but it was a delicious assortment of Vietnamese-inspired dishes. So we ate as much of it as we could, and then we went off to La Ronde, which is Montreal's amusement park, and they were having the international fireworks competition, so that was quite cool. And then, of course, it's an amusement park, so you can also play games, find stuff to eat and drink, and go on rides. The next day, we went to the Fairmont, the Queen Elizabeth, to have brunch at Rosalie's. This is quite a high-end, sophisticated brunch, as you can see. Very yummy food, a very nice way to start our day. And then from there, we just went upstairs in the hotel to Nakarat, which is the terrace bar. Every year at this time, they have an event called Drama Queen, where you can have some cocktails, listen to great music, and see drag performances like Lady Boom Boom from Canada's Drag Race. And from there, we went to the Tea Dance Closing Festival at the Olympic Park Esplanade, where there are two stages with big areas in front to dance. There's different DJs playing, just hours of dancing if you've got the stamina. But we also wanted to check out the Verdun area because it's been named one of the coolest neighborhoods in the world by Time Out. And we went to Biba for dinner, which has food inspired by the Spanish and Italian cultures that settled in Argentina. Delicious. And that was our visit to Montreal during Fierté Montréal. Thanks for watching and make sure you follow me on Instagram to see photos from our trip as well. Bye! Bye!